Hey guys, Nick the Tech Kid here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make your Camtasia videos more smoother and better quality uh, while recording, and like how you can produce it to make it smoother and better quality. So right now I'm recording with Camtasia Studio 5. The reason for that is I can, um, this this method of making smoother recordings and higher quality videos works for like mostly for Camtasia Studio 6 and 5 but right now I'm just using 5 to record so just for an example alright so what you want to do is open up your Camtasia Studio you know, whatever whichever one you have and just let it load alright so uh, you'll get the menu and what you want to click is record the screen and um, okay don't worry about that you want to select full screen to record your whole entire screen or unless you want custom to record one part of your screen you can even include your camera um, choose your audio settings so I'm gonna use my microphone that I'm using uh, so after you've configured your settings you want to click on tools at the top then click options then under file it'll be saved as doc camera but you want to save it as an AVI and the reason for that is it'll make you get HD quicker and it's just better for YouTube to process and yeah also you wanna check disable screensaver during capture because you don't want that popping up during your recording also you wanna uh, check hide capture rectangle that'll also increase the smoothness of your recordings then after you're done with the capture capture tab you wanna move on to the video tab and video configuration it'll be automatic but you want to set it to manual then screen capture rate you want to set it to 30 frames per second and screen capture codec click on under screen, screen capture codec click on video compression leave the compressor where it is um, keyframe should be checked and make sure you make it 30 frames then click OK after that um, like I said you can choose your audio you can choose how big you want the volume to be uh, these three don't really matter right now, um, they're all good, uh, unless you want to configure that by yourself, doesn't matter, So, but right now we're focusing on this. Alright, so after you're done, just click OK, uh, then click record and start recording your video, and after you're done, you want to, after, you, after your video has been saved into your Camtasia Studio folder, you want to click under the Produce tab, Batch Production, then click on add file slash project and let's just say I recorded one video so I'm gonna put one video here okay so after you have all the after, after you have the file saved you wanna click on next then you wanna click on preset manager and you wanna click on new and what I'm gonna name this preset is YouTube uh, smooth high definition that's just an example uh, you can you can choose whatever you want and for the file format instead of take uh, instead of using MOV you want to click on mp4 slash SWF flash output the reason for this is because um, if you haven't wondered that um if you haven't noticed that whenever you like this is what I've noticed whenever I render something in MOV like during the rendering po process in Camtasia it always freezes and I always have to restart it and it takes a long time it literally took me two hours to upload uh, to render eight eight minutes of video so mp4 actually speeds up that process while keeping the same great quality and it is the recommended format for online viewing and it'll make your video smoother without MOV having that lag all the time um, okay so after you chose mp4 flash output just click next after that um, you want to select custom size at the under the size you want to click custom size then video width uh, you, you should put your screen resolution um, if you don't know what that is then then just uh, make the video with 1280 by 720 because that'll that'll upload it into HD automatically um, but I'm just gonna put in my screen resolution then I'm just gonna click next after that and then if you want you can include a watermark if you want um, I don't have a model watermark for this but after you've done that just click finish and click close and click cancel then under add you want to click on import media sorry if I'm going too fast you could just always remind the video or just ask me a question in the comments below 
then I'm gonna upload it and then I'm gonna import a video add it to the timeline um, and under presets I want to choose my preset that I just made so YouTube smooth high definition then I want to click OK then I then I'll just start editing whatever I want with this and after I'm done editing under the produce app ag again I'll just cl click produce a video as and choose my preset then click next then um, name my production so test 2 because I've already recorded once before but and post production options you can show your production results or you can play the video after production I, I don't want either of those because I know it'll turn out great so then click next then click finish and then um, it'll start rendering your video quickly and without any pauses in the middle and after you're done that you can upload it to YouTube and in a, f in a matter of moments your your YouTube video will be smooth and it'll be great quality for your view for for your viewers um, please leave a comment rate subscribe um, more videos will be coming soon if you don't understand anything with this video just personal message me or just comment below I'll reply of course um, I won't ignore your comments um, please rate oh yeah I said that before sorry um, check out my Twitter everything will be in the sidebar all you need to know no downloads for this by the way so that saves your memory and yeah thanks for watching guys i hope you have a great day bye